Hi, uh, this is Mishmark Obi, and today I got a review a, a very nice German watch. This is a Damasco, the DS30. Uh, it uses the ETA movement, uh, 2824, uh, but it has a very interesting um, steel that is used. It's a German submarine steel, as you can see here. So, this German uh, submarine steel is uh, effectively slightly better in terms of the normal 316L. Uh, because of some of the components or, or um, materials uh, it, it used um, and it also looks quite cool in fact it looks more like uh, titanium in terms of the sh in terms of the uh, shade uh, by steel it's stainless steel now you look at the watch very simple um, although you, have, you don't notice it's first glance but there is a date functionality as you can see close to three o'clock none of the hour markers are truncated to fit in like the aperture the date aperture and so on and so forth the hands is very simple fully loomed um, and the markers as well so it's a simple watch uh, screw down crown um, nice uh, old uh, leather strap as you can see here signed um, buckle um, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a simple watch, uh, everyday watch, casual watch. Uh, um, you can use still use it in the uh, in a form of thing. Now, um, I know it's some it may not be for most people uh, because it's, um, because of the uh, style of the of the dial itself. Very simple, nothing much to shout out. Uh, you can just see the name and the logo, and that's it. Uh, of course, made in Germany, right at the bottom there is more font. That's it. That's all you can find on the dial itself. But because of this simplicity, simplicity is easy to refer to. You look at it, you know what's the time. So um, let me shake it a bit to just show you what I mean. So now you can see it's moving. Very simple. You can see it. You know it is nine uh, nine fifty one. Uh, the seconds hands also uh, is it's it's exact you can see uh, where in the uh, long uh, minute markers or, or second markers where it is so you don't need to judge you can see that it actually crosses over so which tells you exactly how to without any second guessing whatsoever um, so it's it's the German design simplicity at its best uh, practicality at its best anyway that's all for today um, there's a link in the description below if you want to know more about this watch uh, but other than that uh, thank you so much for watching do hope do i hope do i do hope that you follow the channel uh, more reviews coming up bye bye for now